tips definitely if you can travel in groups uh, definitely travel in groups around campus campus itself is pretty safe but definitely keep an awareness of the help phones that are around campus they're a blue pole with a blue light on it uh, that you can hit in the event that you just need directions or if there is an incident that you would like to report make sure that people generally know where you are you know, if you're going to class, if you're going to work, if you're going to hang out and get coffee, you definitely want to make sure that people have an idea of where you are and if you don't record at a certain point, that they can generally reach you and say, hey, is everything okay? The garages and lots are patrolled by both members of public safety and the parking services staff, but it's always an important aspect of safety to keep your vehicle locked. I know a lot of people may not be used to doing that, but that is something that's very important uh, to keep the wrong people from entering your vehicle. Additionally, for car safety, always make sure uh, that you are not driving with you know, your cell phone or anything like that. That is something that the Parking Services Office does offer a pledge to you know, end distracted driving, just as a way to make sure we reduce any safety incidents related to texting and driving or any other cell phone usage. The Bearcat Guardian application will allow you to receive direct, um, direct messages and direct alerts, push notifications related to inclement weather or any other incident that may be occurring on campus. In addition, you can sign up at uc.edu slash alert and enroll your cell phone number. Also, I want students to know that there is the non-emergency dispatch number is located right on the back of your UCID card. It's 556-1111. We offer the night ride service, uh, so students that are uh, commuting from within three miles of campus, uh, there are vans, officially branded university vans that can go and pick them up from wherever they are and drop them pretty close, if not directly in front of whichever university building they are going to. Public Safety offers a plethora of resources related to the safety of students, faculty, and staff on campus, both the Bearcat Guardian application that I've been mentioning many times. There's also the Night Ride application. It is also a separate app that you can download from both the Google Play and Apple Store. There's a bike registration page as well uh, where you also could request a lock, uh, a, a U-lock for your bicycle uh, that would be provided by Public Safety. Not so sure if that's free, but definitely is something worth checking out. You can also register your bicycle in the event that something does occur and your bike goes missing, or even if you just misplace it, they will know what make and model your bike is, color, things like that.